Hey everybody, last time on the last remnant we defeated the Fallen. And this time around we're actually going to continue the story, which hopefully won't get interrupted by quests too quickly. But in order to actually reach the Underwalt, which is where we're heading next, we need to make sure we have both the quests, the Fallen, and the Gates of the Seat and the Swords of the Dead done. Because if they are not done, they will be lost forever. So what we need to do is we need to head to Bereshvatel. So all we really need to do is just kind of head straight through. I already have the map for this place. It's an area I never really bothered going through. There are two different paths I can go. I don't know which way is which. So I might as well just uncover both of them. But this area isn't anything too special in the slightest. As long as we just head through here, it's not a big deal. Okay. Later. All right. So I'm just going to head towards the left one first and open up that location. And then, if it's not the right one, I could just head down towards the south one. It's not a terrible loss if I'm going in the wrong way, either or. And thankfully, I still have this fast forward button because pretty useful. <laughs> That's one thing that this version definitely has over the PC version is being able to just hold the button down. Hello there. Why are you here again? We have a vicious monster up ahead. So long as it's there, you can't get home. I'll take care of it. Alright, so it looks like we have a rare monster ahead. So at Mount Vackle. Okay, so this is the area that I actually am heading towards. So essentially what it seems like I need to head through Mount Vackle and fight some sort of monster at the end in order to actually progress towards the Underwalt. It's almost like this game, remember that, oh wait, we have like many different areas they can travel through. So why don't you just uh, go do that with one of these areas here. It looks like the monsters aren't really too different or special in this area compared to the area I was just in. So it's not that big of a deal. I mean, they're still going to be about the same as like as about as powerful as they are when you level scale and stuff. But whatever, I'll just kind of head through here. I want to find a map. But if I don't find a map, then I might as well find something. Hello, can I grab that from you? How? How? Oh, wait, duh. <laughs> I was playing another game in the meantime, and I uh, forgot that I had to do the R2 thing. <laughs> My bad. Not a terrible loss in the grand scheme of things, because all I really need to do is just uh, kind of wreck them myself. So let's let's do that really quick. Been a while since I had a standard battle actually be shown on camera. It's just the usual nonsense of me killing things like that. Especially with counters. Awesome. There, there was only one group. Just the beginning. Who wants to be my guinea pig? Okay. Nah, I'm totally fine with that. <laughs> I felt like there would be more than one. I didn't even count or look. Alright, is this a map? Perfect. Got the map. So, looks like there's only one area to go through. So it's not gonna be too hard to get lost here. What's this? Divine okay, metal. Later. All right. At least we know that we're heading along. The stuff I'm finding is about on par with everything I have been finding, anyway. I also know that there's a Mr. Diggs morsel somewhere around here. Hello, vultures. Actually, I believe some of my party members are like wanting these. Wait, I still can't even do these anyway. Because I don't have the necessary pieces. Whatever. Alright, moving along here. Nope. <laughs> don't even think about it. Alright, I still don't see what I was necessarily looking for. Kind of stinks a little bit, but it's not a terribly big deal. I could always come back for it. Oh wait, I think it's actually in this area, right? Where, where am I at on the map? Pearly Peak, yeah, it's in this area. Um, there's like a little uh, morsel for Mr. Diggs somewhere around here. Might as well get it because why not? Is this it? Come on out. No, that's okay, just a rep later. weapon. Hello, two things, one of these has to be it. There's Come no way on. that they would have two red things right next to each other. 
Okay. Atrocious pot. Good job. There it is. Mm -hmm. Awesome. There we go. Okay. Later. Let's see. More vultures. Not a big deal there. Still not exactly what I'm looking for. There is a monster that is blocking the path. And it's clearly not any of these guys because I can walk right by them, no problem. Are they guarding anything special? Yes, they are. Hello, bye-bye. Hmm, neat. All right. Anyways, moving along. We've reached the peak. We're getting further and further. I do have a map, I forgot that, oh, whatever. <laughs> I feel like that I'm not grabbing stuff, but I am. I don't know, I'm like, oh, okay. Even cooler, got two more formations. Hi. You clearly look like the monster I'm looking for. Come on out. Let me grab this while I'm here. Okay, Thank you. Later. Hello. Can I tag you? There we go. Let's get this not in a uh, bad position. All right, so we need to defeat the Heaven's Lord in order to get through here. I could easily do that by actually doing a lot of damage. So let's get started. Hmm. That could be useful. <laughs> Let's see on, how that works. Way. I mean, it's already going, so it's still already doing something, so it's even better for me. Because then I could just get rid of what it, the heck it might do later. But we shall see. Oh, great. It does curses. Fun times. Okay. <laughs> it didn't even work. I'm totally fine with that. Well, it's gonna be doing it all for my group, so I might as well see how well things go for me. Thank you. There we go. Make sure we get it before he goes. And then that should ruin like everything else he's gonna do. Probably, maybe, I don't know. Aha! What now? Attack them from that flight. Oh. You can't even attack me. Well, it's a flank attack, but either way, you can't attack me. You burnt on top of a snowy mountain. It's all good, we, we got this. If I continue striking from the sides, we should be okay. More damage, and um, sure, why not? Make it so he can't do any. Oh, he knows Cahexia too. Fun times. I'm gonna make sure I go before he does. There's nothing you can do now, especially for this group. I mean, you could do damage to them, but uh, we pretty much got this one in the bag. Oh, great. <laughs> That's a good start. Oh, fun. That, that group just got slaughtered. All right, let's make sure you don't attempt another Cahexia, which you're going to do, so how about no? It's a good thing I did learn that move because otherwise this would be uh, a little bit more of a hassle than it is. And strike from the side, you can't do anything. Thank you. I don't need two curings, but that, that's totally fine. <laughs> don't mind it, kid. The only thing I really do to fix that is prioritize uh, Emmy on top and then just switch them around and then she will do stuff first. Okay, okay. And just kind of make sure we have the way things going, the way things are. This boss has been a nothing, but I can't see anything the entire battle <laughs> because the, the wings keep getting in the way of all the camera views. Good effort. How strong is this guy? Because it's still not like blinking red. I mean, it's definitely nothing compared to, oh really? <laughs> all right. Torgal effectively has 7,000 health right now. <laughs> But it's okay, we got this one off. So 
that's damage at least. Could be better though. Okay, let's do some more damage, please. There we go, silence is gonna help a little bit. Seriously, you are still not blinking. I mean, I haven't really done that much damage, honestly, but still, I feel like this guy yeah, should be this uh, much, oh, he is blinking, Never mind. I was just, because the other thing was just kind of covering it up. Um, You know what? Attack from afar because you haven't re really. <laughs> a lot of good that's gonna do you now. All right, let's do this. Are you even trying? Oh, okay, this is gonna hurt. Maybe, maybe not. Eh, that wasn't terribly bad at all. And damage. There we go. Um, Torvo, you're fine. You have 7,000 health. <laughs> Supposedly. Ow. Okay, that could be a problem. Don't get hit. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Please die already. All right. Uh, you know what? You cancel deadlock, see if you can heal. Just so you don't die. <laughs> I mean, it's doing a standard attack, so I'm not too worried, but still. There we go. Well, that was kind of dumb. <laughs> oh, nice. You know what? I kind of want those things. I'm going to do that. Okay. Okay. And all that in order to get to the Underwalt. Which once we step inside, I'm going to make a backup save for this just in case. <laughs> Not going uh, I would recommend doing this, do a backup save just in case you never know. Uh, but I already have everything I, like I already mentioned the two quests, the Fallen and the Gaze of the Siege of Swords of the Dead. I already have those done. I'm fine. I just keep second guessing myself. So let's enter the Underwalt. But now that we're in the Underwall, we could actually check out a couple things here. We have the Blessed Chime Poob. We have the Union of the Golden Chalice. Let's head inside there, see if I have any tasks that are already complete just for me being here. Let's find out. Uh, nobody to employ except for you having a ridiculous amount. Hey, look at that. Got one right there. Nice. Nice. All right, so there are still a lot of guild tasks I need to do. Uh, you tell me about the Sea Ember, right? Yep. Okay, so if I talk to him, he unlocks like another Sea Ember path whenever I head into the open world map, and then, hey, another one. Let's see, what else is in this area? Uh, nothing too special. Let's check out you. Ancient wine and earth seeds, which black oil, I'm gonna... Not a hundred, not a hundred, not not even that close. Uh, I'll do like ten. <laughs> okay, and then ancient vine. They don't really cost that much. Uh, I'm just gonna do that. And then I'll not eighty-eight. Come on, game, please stop. Uh, I'm gonna buy like ten. There we go. All right. Now locks a couple more areas here. We have. Uh, the Castellum, which is where we're going to be heading in a bit, but let's check out, uh, Geffrey. Uh, 
Alright, anybody special? What the heck? Shield of Remembrance. Ah, oh, well, a little late for that now. <laughs> I don't really need that. Alright, let's see. Can I customize anything since I am here? Nope. Alright, not a big deal there. Can I buy anything from you? Garbage, garbage, garbage. Uh, that's not garbage in the slightest, but I don't really see myself needing it. This, on the other hand, uh, it's basically the same thing, so a little bit more expensive. Not a big deal there. And then item arts plus 5%. I don't really need that. And then whatever that is, that kind of stinks. It's another timed thing. It might show up. It might not. Let's see. What do we got here? I don't have that. That's 40-something thousand. Let's make sure to... Sure. Might as well make sure to stock up while I'm here. Okay. I don't need to really max out on everything. All right. Moving on. Hello there. Let's finish the quest really quick. Have you noticed? Probably not. But like the people here don't pay attention to you unless you're wearing the latest brands. That's supposed to be the Imperial City. Shouldn't the people here be less materialistic or some junk? Anyways, I've been thinking. I should go back to nature. So I'm selling this sweet... How do you say that? Kyrenia? Kyrenia. Whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna buy it for 20000 It's up to your style by 1,000%. Sounds hot. I'll buy it. Thanks. Venom plus 5. Hopefully somebody will want that. Totally over you, Underwalt. Toodles! Alright, that's another quest done. Which is nice because, you know, all the other areas that I haven't visit, well, that I have visited anyway, that she wasn't in. Um, one, two, I think there's like four of them. Uh, there's Baltarosa, there's Rayosha, Melfina, and then Baluk. She'll be in all those areas. Easy quest, just spend some money or whatever the heck she wants, and there you go, there's more. And then there's another quest as well. Now we have the Castellum. Let's head in there. That's essentially where we're supposed to be heading. I come as acting chairman of the Congress, Marquis David Nassau of Athlon. I am honored to be here in your excellency's presence. Today is truly a memorable day for the people of Athlon as there is no greater glory than receiving the opportunity for an audience with Your Excellency. Enough. Your Excellency? Enough empty formalities, Marquis. They are ever so... impersonal. Peasant or vassal, we treat all as equals. Such deference is unnecessary. Would you not agree? Whatever pleases His Excellency. What a weirdo. Shh. Marquis of Athlum, we have heard of your many achievements. To accomplish so much at such a young age is quite impressive. Surely your father looks down on you with pride. Oh, uh, you are too kind. Your Excellency, I come bearing a question. Concerns about the Conqueror. Tis a tricky topic, though we would like nothing more than to satisfy your desire for enlightenment. The Conqueror's actions are destroying the world's balance. Without question, he must be stopped. Please, you must tell us what you know. <laughs> destroying the balance of the world, you say? A frightening man indeed. Your Excellency, were you not the one who bestowed power upon this man? What were your intentions? <laughs> But a mere child you are, Marquis. You see not but what's before your face. Your, 
You are Arena Sykes. I yes. Then you are she who bears the blood of Marshall? Hmm. The Lady Marion's beauty lies within. Marquis, in deference to the blood of our ancient consort, the Conqueror's secrets we will reveal. However, make certain you have the courage to proceed. <laughs> Okay, so now, if we enter that teleporter, we lose out on a quest, which we already done, the Gets to see the Swords of the Dead. So make sure that you have that quest done before you step in there. But, before we do, we have some more quests to do. There's not too much left, thankfully. So I am going to get all of them done as soon as possible, which will probably be the next episode. A lot of them are pretty short. Some of them, not a little bit long, but... With that, next time on The Last Remnant Remastered, I'll see you all then.